guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you've been sparkling and shining since we last talked. Today I want to show you my Sephora haul. A couple weeks ago they had 20% off all already sale priced items. So I stocked up on some things and then I also got some things that weren't on sale just because I'm a makeup addict. So let's go ahead and begin. The Sephora Color of the Year items, the lipstick ombre pencils. And I didn't get the lipstick because I prefer pencil crayons. So I'm really excited to swatch these and see how they last. I really love Sephora's uh, crayon formula. I got a set of their glossy sticks for Christmas and they were fantastic. Next thing I got was the blush palette. I actually returned the 50 Shades of Grey blush palette so that I could get this one. Um, I just wasn't a fan of those colors from the Fifty Shades of Grey. So, and finally, the palette, the eyeshadow palette. Um, look at those colors. I swatched this in the store the day after Christmas, and I fell in love. I love these colors. I love the shine. I love the way I put a little bit on my eyes, and it lasted all day. And that was even without primer. If you'd like to see me review these in detail, or give some first impressions. Or do a demo with them just give me a thumbs up comment below on what you'd like to see and I'll get that done for you the next couple items are skincare Sephora dark spot minimizing cream I do have some dark spots not really on my face but on my hands where I'm really starting to age I'm excited to see how that works on those and then I got the Sephora liquid moisturizing lotion this is supposed to be something that you put on before your moisturizer to retain more moisture. I'm not sure if I'm going to use it that way. Um, I'm going to try and use it actually just as a moisturizer and see how that works. The next thing I got was these Boja blotting papers in peppermint because I do have combination skin and get a little oil in my T-zone. Plus, they're peppermint and I love peppermint m ms so I'm sure I'll love these. This, I already have one already. And it is a travel makeup brush. It's perfect for your purse. These caps screw off and there's an angled brush on one side that you can use for blush or contour. And then the other side is a face brush. So it's great. You can put it in your purse, your travel bag to go. I want to start learning how to use eyeliner with an angled brush. That's one of the next things I want to start learning how to do. So I got three of these Sephora eyeliner pots. And they are in the colors Cafe, which is... A rich chocolate brown made in Manhattan which is a cloudy blue and bewitch me which is a plum purple so I'm excited to try those out I'll probably do a tutorial with them um, like I said I've never really used eyeliner with an angled brush before I usually just do pins or gels or pencils so if you have any tricks or know of any great videos please let me know down in the comments. I'm running out of nail things, and so since it was on sale for five dollars plus twenty percent off, I got two bottles of the Sephora nail polish remover that has really great reviews. I got a bunch of the Sephora nail polishes that were on sale for a dollar in the old formula. I prefer more than the new Formula X. Okay, they don't say the name of the colors on them, so I will just hold them up. This is yellow, a bright, bright, sunshiny yellow. This one is an iridescent mermaid blue. Great springtime orange. A clear nail polish coat. A charcoal gray. Another clear polish. This one is a really pretty deep magenta pink. Lilac purple. Shiny red. You can see that flex of like purple iridescent showing up in the camera. Tons of perfume samples. I bought a perfume atomizer off of Amazon.com for like 99 cents. And so I'll get like five packets of Alien and I'll put them all in the atomizer and I'll have a good half an ounce of perfume. So I love to do that. And that is it. I hope you enjoyed my Sephora haul. I'm sure I'll do more in the future. If you'd like to see a demo or review of any of the products that I shared today, just let me know down in the comments. Um, if you like these videos, if you want to see more, either plus size fashion hauls or makeup reviews or anything like that, uh, click subscribe and give me a thumbs up. And I hope you have a fantastic day. And remember, always sparkle and shine.